we're at another property here. The customer just wanted the inside of the fence line, so we decided to do the push mowing instead of fighting with the mower. The guys are just weed eating and push mowing the inside. Uh, here in a couple weeks, we do mow the whole property, which is this whole field. Uh, it is a weekly, and that's just one side of it. We got the other side over here. Sorry about the wind, guys. Uh, yeah, it's kind of windy today. And so then, probably start all this in the next week or two. As I mentioned in my last video, we might be dealing with some snow and stuff here in a couple days. But all that, all that down to the wood line. Of course, this fenced in backyard. It goes all the way down to the wood line. I think it's about five acres. I could be wrong. I think maybe a little less. I don't remember exactly at the moment. But uh, yeah, I figure I'll show you guys another yard. We finished with that last one. The pressure washing and the gutter cleaning. The customer was very happy. It turned out pretty good. Uh, Man, we got the Echo PB770T. As I mentioned, I'll I'll make a thorough video, kind of go into depth and maybe like a honest review of everything and what I think. And we got the Steel BR450. Man, we put a beating on this blower. I mean, as you can tell, we even had this taped up here, but we put a beating. Uh, got the BG86 right here. Uh, Man, again, put a huge beating on that mower, on that blower as well. Uh, besides that one steel, we run the Echoes to uh, 2620s. And then, of course, got the Skag 48 inch. 15 horses, 603. Or 3600 RPMs, I mean, <clears throat> with the Kawasaki engine. And of course, the Velky. Uh, looks like we're done here. Well, stay tuned. I'll keep you guys posted.